Today we are going to talk about a disease which we usually used to associate with children or at a very early age of life that is chicken pox. However, we are finding that in the society, in the medical news, we find that even in adults, chicken pox is making its impact and it is coming back. So how do we usually identify with that or how would the patient understand that this can be chicken pox? Usually the disease starts with a low grade fever with constitutional symptoms in the form of body ache, headache, upper respiratory tract symptoms in the form of a sore throat, a cough, coriza. And after that, after a period of around 2-3-4 days, you start seeing that there are rashes appearing all over the body. There is a very typical pattern of this chicken pox rash that is it is usually vesicular in nature and it appears at all parts of the body, in the limbs, in the trunk and other parts. It also happens over the face. It is usually itchy in character and till a point of time that all these rashes scab off, the patient is usually considered to be infectious. So till the point of time, a patient has all these symptoms in the form of fever, upper respiratory tract symptoms along with this typical rash of chicken pox. The patient is considered infectious and should ideally isolate or keep himself or herself secluded from the close contact of near and dear ones because the disease would be spread by close contact so we have to be very careful about it. When can we say that the patient is usually non-infectious? When all the rashes have scabbed off and there is no residual constitutional symptoms then we usually say that the patient is disease free. What is the role of medications? Usually if the medication is started in the first 48 hours of the disease onset then antivirals might have a role. Otherwise antibiotics can be selectively used on condition and decision of the practitioner because in order to prevent super infection if any. Otherwise for the itching part we usually use the antihistaminics and also skin soothing creams. So we have to remember that chicken pox is making a return back into the adult uh, form so it is very easily detectable and once the mentioned features appear in the patient we should not hesitate, we should not be taking much time but get in touch with our practitioner so that we can start the treatment early.